the House of Representatives yesterday passed a piece of legislation. Gee, what a surprise. They actually can pass laws uh, and that don't repeal Obamacare, although they did, they, you know, they tried to do that again, not yesterday, but in this last week. But uh, this was a bill that would specifically benefit people like the Koch brothers. It's on Wednesday, this from uh, Politico, Kenneth, Ken Vogel and Hillary Flynn writing, the House on Wednesday with little fanfare hmm, and virtually no media coverage. I, the, I added that part. Passed legislation that would project that would protect major donors like the Koch brothers, and then they got to throw in Tom Steyer, right? And Tom Steyer from having to pay gift taxes on huge donations to secret money political groups. I could be wrong about Tom Steyer, but I think he's been pretty transparent, and he's not using secret money groups. He's using, um, you know, nonprofits, but the ones that disclose. But I could be I could be wrong. I I think not, but I could be wrong on that. And I think that the, you know they just threw Tom Steyer in there to throw a throw a sop to the who will get hysterical when they say, oh, you know, the Republicans in the House of Representatives just passed something that will help the Republican donors. But really, it's uh, the major generate the, the major recipients of this. Well, actually, it says uh, Tom Steyer's next gen climate is a five hundred one c four. Yeah. Uh, the that covers the, the bill passed Wednesday would make clear that the gift tax does not apply to groups registered under Section 501c4, 5, or 6, and that covers a wide swath of organizations. This is from the political article, including everything from the Carl Rove conceived Crossroads GPS and Tom Steyer funded Next Gen Climate, both of which are 501c4s, to major labor, labor unions, 501c5s, to the Koch brothers backed Freedom Partners Chamber of Commerce, 501c6. A six. Amazing. Well, interesting to see. I mean, this this is an effort to make big money in politics even more opaque, not more transparent. So whether you know it's gotten out of the house. Of course, the house is run by by uh, uh, right wing shill Republican shills for the billionaires and the big corporations. Whether it'll make it through the Senate, where the Democrats still assert some authority, and whether the president would sign it, which I'd be very skeptical about.